Hi everyone, it's Kathy and welcome to today's Fit, Fast and Fun workout. So today is a quick but intense ab blast. We're gonna be focusing on the whole rectus abdominis and your external internal rotators. So your obliques are gonna get, uh, get targeted as well. Um, this is a great workout that you could tack on to a walk, a run, uh, maybe strength, maybe an additional core workout. All right, just something to kind of focus on those abdominal muscles. All right, so let's get started. We're gonna lean back or lay back, I should say. This will be part of our warm up. So I want you to lay all the way back on the floor and walk the feet in, so a slight bend in those knees. Abs are in, so you wanna pull that belly button in and try to get that back flat to the floor. Your hands are gonna be lightly behind your head just to support that neck. We're gonna bring our head all the way to the floor. We're gonna crunch straight up for five. Five. Remember to use that breath to, to four. <laughs> I lost my count already. Three, you might be in trouble. Two, nice work. And one. Now we're gonna take the left elbow and cross it over to the right knee five times. Two, so we're just starting to just get that, that uh, ab warmed up. Three, four, and five. Now switch sides. Five, four, three, two, don't forget your breath, and one. Now we're gonna lift those knees and we're gonna round towards the center here and take it down. So it's a little reverse hip lift here, a little reverse abs, so we're getting a nice uh, lower portion of our abs included here. Four, you got one more, and five. Beautiful, we're gonna do that again. Straight crunches up, up. Remember to really push that belly button down into the floor. You don't wanna have any space, but keep pushing up. Three, elbows stay wide. Four, and five. Now we're gonna go into this oblique cross. Five, so I'm just slightly picking this up. Four, Three, don't hold your breath. Two, and one, switch sides. Elbow reaching across to the opposite knee. Two, three, four, and five. Reverse curl, crunch it in and tap. Crunch it in and tap. Three, four, nice. And five, we're gonna do one more round as our last set here. Two, three, four, and five. Take it across for five, for four, for three, for two, and one. Take it, switch sides here for five, for four, for three, you should already be starting to feel those abs for two, and this is just the warm up. You got it, five reverse curls for five, for four, for three, for two, for one. Beautiful, now just hug those knees in, bring your head back to the floor, just drop them to the right. Grab an inhale, exhale, let's drop them to the left. Awesome work. All right, staying onto your back, I want you to take your right leg and extend it long. So your left leg is gonna be bent. So the further this leg is here, the easier this is on your core. So if you wanna really intensify it, you'll walk that foot a little further up. So I'm just gonna kind of start in the middle of the road here. So just a comfortable position here. So we're gonna roll our body up. We're gonna lift that leg. We're gonna roll up four times. So it's one, two, three, four. Then you're just gonna rotate to that side and then Pilates roll down. And then you're gonna do that again, all the way up, all right? So go with what feels comfortable for you and do it at a pace that's right for you. All right, so here we go, lay back. Leg is gonna be lifted to the sky. Pull the belly in, climb that leg. One, two, three, four. Rotate, lower. One, two, three, Four, rotate and lower. So scoop that belly. One, two, three, four. Rotate, roll down. One, two, three, four. Rotate, roll down. Beautiful, really feel that scoop going on as you come up into that reach. Rotate and roll down. Good, up, two, three, four. Rotate, 
roll down, you've got 10 seconds. Up, two, three, four, rotate, roll down. It's your last one like this, two, three, four, rotate, and roll down. Beautiful, give that leg a nice little hug in, in and out. All right, now you're gonna, just gonna straighten that leg, and you're gonna take that bottom leg, you're gonna straighten that bottom leg. So you're gonna take your opposite elbow, and we're just gonna cross it, across. All right, reach it, pulling, lifting up through that shoulder, and rotating across to that straight leg. Inhale, exhale, don't forget that breath. Pulling that belly button in, keeping that core engaged the entire time. Inhale, exhale, breathe. Press it out. 15 seconds like this. Forget that breath. Elbow going across to the outside of that knee. You got four more. Three more. Two left. Good. Here's your last one right here. Awesome work. Now I want you to hold here. All right, now that bottom leg, lift it. And now just lift and lower. Now, if you're feeling that this is too hard for you, bend that leg and do it like this. All right, so you have options. Come on, let's go. Down and up. Whoop, really pull that belly button in, keeping that back flat. Whoop. If your back is arching or that spine is arching, please bend that leg, bring it to the floor. Four, three, two, and one, and up and hug. Woo, that was crazy hard, yes? Nice work, woo. All right, so we are gonna switch sides. And do that same thing on the other side. So keep right leg bent, left leg is gonna be lifted. We're gonna roll up, rotate to that side. Inhale, here we go. Roll it up, two, three, four, rotate, roll down, good. Up. Two, I had a little trouble getting up there. Rotate, roll down. Up, two, three, four. Rotate, roll. So really slow and articulate through that roll down. Rotate, oh yeah. Come on, up, two, three, four. You need that breath. And roll. Up, two, three, four. Rotate, roll down. Two, three, four, rotate, roll down. Two more, Hup. two, three, four, rotate. Good work, guys. Drive, 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 rotate. Yeah, give that knee a little hug. Breathe in and out. You're gonna extend that leg to the sky. Straighten the bottom leg. Going into those obliques, here we go, across. Good, remember that hand is just to support your neck. I want you to really rotate from that elbow to the outside of that knee, really using those abs. Again, pressing that belly button down into the floor. You wanna add that breath, fight for that engagement. You've got 10 seconds here. Good job, let's do three more. Three, two, Remember, you're gonna hold here. Now lift that bottom leg, lift and lower, lift and lower. Remember, lower that leg or bend that bottom leg if you need it, or I shouldn't say bottom leg, the opposite leg, right? Up and down, up, down, really push with that belly. This is intense, guys. This is intense. So don't be afraid to modify here. All right, so do what's right for you. Remember, it's a quick ab last. Three more. Three, two, and one. That was fire. That was fire. <laughs> Just rock it side to side. Woo, I told you it was gonna be intense, right? All right, so come on up for just a quick second. Grab some inhales and exhales. So we're gonna start in a long leg position here. We're gonna scoop down. We're gonna cross our arms over um, having our fingertips touch our, each opposite end of our shoulder. So we're gonna scoop. Let me show you first. We're gonna hold in the scooped position. You're gonna rotate towards one side, elbow to the floor, come back to center, and you're gonna do the other side. So it's really important that you keep that scoop going on, that chest and shoulders are back, that you're not arching through your spine or your neck. All right, so if you have, 
If it really gets to be intense, come back and sit up right here. Grab a quick stretch and start all over again. All right, so let's scoop the belly in, nice tall posture, cross those hands. Let's scoop and roll down, hang out here. Here we go. One, two, three, center. Two, two, three, center. Three, two, three, center. Four, two, three, center. Five, two, three, center. Six, two, three, center. Seven, center. Eight, two, three, center. Nine, two, three, center. Ten, two, three. Ten more. Ten, two, three. Eleven, two, three. Keep scooping. Thirteen. 14, 2, 3, 15, 16, 17, keep scooping, 18, 19, and 20. Woo! Pull it up. Ha! Ah, how did that feel? Did you feel that? All right, so we're going to take it down. We're almost done, guys, believe it or not. So we're going to bring our body back down to the floor. Hands are gonna be right next to our hips. We're gonna bring those legs up long. Now we're gonna do a reverse hip lift. So we're gonna lift this lower portion of our body, bringing our heels to the sky. So it helps to have your hands here to help lift you up. So you're gonna lift and lower. Now I don't want those feet coming here. They're going straight up and down. So it's a lift. Slow, I want you to control it. Nice and easy like this. Flex the feet, think of the heels imprinting towards the ceiling. Nice work. Put your focus in that low ab and breathe. Good work. Awesome. Now we're going to change this up after four. Remember, straight up, not over that head. Two more and one. Now we're going to corkscrew this. So as I lift, I'm going to rotate my heels towards one side, come back down, rotate them to the other. So here's what it looks like. Corkscrew really focusing on that app and that rotation. Here we go. Hup. Core screw. Feet are flexed, heels towards the sky. Ugh. It's small. All right, you're just doing a small little lift. Corkscrew. Ankles or heels towards one side. Push through those hands. Ooh. Yep, four more. Three more. Two more. And last one here. Oh, yeah, hug it in. Rock yourself side to side. Whoo, grab yourself an inhale. We are flipping over to our last and final move. So we're gonna come into a little bit of a planking here. So how this is gonna work is you're gonna come into a full plank. You're gonna give me four slow mountain climbers. Right, left, right, left. Then we're gonna come down to our forearms. They're gonna give me four Spider-Man's, all right, on your forearms. We're gonna come back up into that full, four slow mountain climbers. All right, so again, planking works your abs in a 360 degree. So it works front to back. So that's why I really like incorporating plank work to the mix because we're gonna target every part of your muscle that you have in that abdominal core region. All right, so here we go, guys. Coming down into a plank position, full. Wrist, shoulders, elbows in nice alignment. Neck is long. Four. Um, slow mountain climbers. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Lower down to your forearms for spiders. So knee towards that elbow. One. Keep that booty down. Two, three, and four. Back up to your plank. Four mountain climbers. Four, three, two. We don't want to speed this up. One. Back down to your forearms. Here we go. Four, Three, two, and one. Back up. Four, three, two, and one. Take it down. Four here. Four, three, two, one. You got one more round like this. Way up. Four, three, two, one. Back down. Four, spiders, four, three, two, and one. Walk yourself back up last time, full-fledged mountain climbers to finish you out. Let's go. 
push it out. Push, push, push. Drive those knees, pull those abs in strong. Nice work, guys, keep going. Good job. Come on now. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Yikes, sit back. Nice work. Woo! Inhale, exhale. Always like to get that heart rate up a little bit, don't I? Big step to one side. Oh, big stretch. Good job. Back to center. Sit back. Take those arms to the opposite side. You got it. Good. Nice and easy, come back to center. Nice work, guys, just pull that body up. Whew, all right, so let's just take one arm under and reach. Take one arm under and reach. We're gonna switch sides right here. Thread it under and reach. Thread it under and reach. Beautiful job. Coming onto those knees, just come into a nice roll back. Pull those shoulders back, nice tall posture. Those torso, three, two, one. Let's just go into some opposition stretches here. Ooh, do you feel those abs? Yeah, four, three, two, and one. Clasp those hands behind you. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Hinge yourself forward. Crown of your head towards the floor. Reach those arms up overhead. Big giant stretch. Grab an inhale, pull it all the way up. We're just gonna end with a quick cat cow and you are done, okay? It's coming into a tabletop position. Pull the belly in, press through those palms, round arch that spine and reverse it. Let that belly flop, your gaze comes up and take it again. Push through those palms, round that spine all the way up, tailbone lifts. Exhale down, head comes up. We've got one last one here. Power, pull the belly in, really hold, 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 hold. Exhale, scoop it up. Sit back one last time in your child pose. Big inhale, big exhale, come onto those knees and give yourself a nice big stretch overhead and you come into your heart center. So that was quick, a bit intense. If you feel good and you wanna do that again, do it again. All right, so we just target a bunch of different areas, quick, fast, and fun, hopefully fun. Fun is what you make it. All right guys, stay well, see you in the next Fit Fast Fun Workout, bye.